Hey guys, it's Rebecca Verstadt. So I wanted to record this a little bit different today. Um, I'm kind of in the middle of doing stuff. So my stool that I usually use to sit on is occupied. I wanted to talk to you about this First Aid Beauty. This is the Ultra Repair Cream. It says intense hydration for dry, parched skin, safe for sensitive skin. Now, uh, for the past couple weeks, I have been kind of like staying away from all my skincare products because I have had some breakouts popping up on my face and some patches on my face are like super, super, super dry. So um, that and I tested out some Amazonian clay foundation from Tarte and that's where this one came from and this one and this one and the one that popped up over here. So my face is a little bit freaked out. So what I had noticed was that using my regular skincare with my anti-aging cleanser, the toner, um, the hyaluronic acid, all that kind of stuff, my skin was just so super dry that it was literally burning every time that I used my skincare. I tried like taking products out of it. I tried um, adding in like other products that are fragrance free, but it comes down to the majority of the skincare that I'm using right now has fragrance in it and it is causing my skin to dry out more than normal. It's causing my skin to burn. Just putting regular water on my face is causing my skin to feel tight and literally burn. So what I got this in my Ipsy Glam bag. I used 600 points from Ipsy to get this product and this is one ounce. It's worth about $6. They sell them in two ounces, four ounces, six, eight, and 12 ounce containers. And they range from like $12 to like 40 something dollars. So I think that is a really good price. It is one of those, if you remember back in the day, all of the products that, that say fragrance free, this has like a slight, um, a slight like medicinal smell to it. And I just go on, I'm gonna, it comes out white. And even though you can see like all of the texture and stuff on my skin, the redness, all the like spots that I've had breakouts, that kind of stuff, my face, and it doesn't feel like sticky or tacky, even though I just put it on my face. Um, I don't know if you can see how dry this side is. Like I have all kinds of like dry spots on my forehead. I have another breakout coming out right there. But look, I even have like a little dry patch there. Let me put a little boop on that. I've got like a bunch of breakouts right here on my forehead because I had the foundation was all caked up in my hair and that stuff was like hell trying to get it off my skin. But now you can see that little dry spot's gone. But I've even like been putting this on my eyebrows. This stuff, it doesn't feel like, you know, granted my skin is a little bit shiny from using it, but it doesn't feel greasy. It doesn't feel heavy on the skin. There's no fragrance in it. My face just even like I've been using it at least twice a day. I've been using it when I first get up in the morning and I wash my face. I've been using it like after my shower or just before I go to bed. Um, just the difference in how soft my face feels and how moisturized it is. I think my skin is ready for me to start bringing back in my regular skincare, which is nice. Um, the fact that it doesn't burn my skin. There's no fragrance in it. I mean, I don't see anything in here ingredient wise that would cause any irritation to my skin. I really don't. And there's a, a few extracts in here. There's oatmeal in here. There's eucalyptus, leaf oil. There's um, a couple of other root extracts, uh, a couple of butters. But other than that, I mean, this has actually got some really good ingredients in it. And like I said, there's no fragrance. There's no fragrance listed on the back of here at all, which is nice. And what I'll do is I will link this product. Um, you can find it at like Ulta for like the large size for I think it's $32 for either eight or 12 ounces and it comes in like a tub uh, and you can use this all over your body. It's not just for your face. They also, I also found it at Sephora with varying sizes anywhere from two ounces on up. So um, I think this is actually something that I will be saving my money to buy a full size of. I have been using the It Cosmetics Confidence in a Cream. This is one of their little tester sizes. This cost me $12. 
but I noticed that when my face started getting really dry because the weather was going from hot to cold to hot to cold to hot to cold, that this was causing my skin to burn. It, if I got it anywhere near my under eyes, my under eyes literally felt like somebody had just taken a hot poker out of the fireplace and stuck it under my eye. So I had to stop using this. The eye cream that I was using that is from Strivectin, I had to stop using this under my eyes or even around my eyes because this was causing my eyes to burn. The glycolic toner that I was using the it's just it's just way too harsh on my skin right now my face is just completely freaked out from the weather so until the weather either figures that it wants to be cold or hot i'm going to be very careful with what skincare that i do use so i am very happy that i found a moisturizer that i can use on my face and my hands and anywhere else that i have you know dry scaly itchy patches that i can use and not have to worry about the fragrance in it or that it, it burns or anything like that so I just wanted to do a really quick review of the First Aid Beauty Ultra uh, Ultra Repair Cream. This stuff is the bomb. And I like the fact that it doesn't have any fragrance in it. And what fragrance you do smell is, is like a light, clean, natural fragrance. It doesn't smell like chemicals or anything. So it's, it's nice. And it leaves my skin super soft and hydrated. And like I said, I've been using it like twice a day and I haven't had a you know, spray my face with the Rose Hydrating Mist. I haven't had to put anything else on my skin for hydration. I mean, this stuff is really kind of like a wham bam, thank you ma'am kind of product. So I really enjoy it. So hopefully you like this little quick review with kind of a different angle from where I'm used to recording. I will see you guys in another video very soon. Hopefully you have a great day or night wherever you are. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down below and share it with your friends. I will see you guys later.